What's up guys, in this video we are going to be testing out the Tamer weapon on the nether. So this robot is actually dead, it got nerfed to the ground. So we're going to be seeing if the Kestrel drone and the new meta weapons can make it viable again. So let's drop into a game with it. Okay, so we have dropped in on Shenzhen map, we'll start off with the nether first. I'm not going to lie, I was so glad when this thing got nerfed. Oh my gosh, I've only got 166,000 health. I absolutely hated the nether. The nether claw meta was absolutely awful. I hated it so much. Right, I think the shield break is actually going to come in handy though against like the Ephian. Oh, this is going to be a tough game. Oh, look at my health already. That is crazy. We need to get kills to stay alive because it will heal my grey damage with the Kestrel Joe. Oh my gosh, I just killed an Ochikochi. What the heck? Oh, I tried to steal that one with the um, the EMP thing. I can't believe I just killed an Ochikochi. That was so lucky. Yeah, let's stay away from him. We basically just need to, like, not draw any attention to ourselves. Double kill. No way. It's the weapons that are keeping it alive. I mean, if we were running, like, the Needle, which was also a really meta build, or... What else was it? The claw before it got nerfed. Then we'd be getting destroyed right now. Can we get the links maybe? Oh, the Ochikochi just came out of nowhere there. My kill got stolen. Oh, look at the damage. Oh my gosh. I lost a weapon from that. Oh my. That was crazy. We need this guy to leave so I can get the beacon. I'm in such a bad position here. I think he's leaving though. Yeah, he actually left. We'll blind him with the mothership so he can't fire at me. And then I'm getting the heck out of here. I guess it's still a little viable as a beacon runner. If you go up against an Ochikochi, then you're like done for. We're on a triple kill though, to be fair. Maybe we can get this hawk for the rampage. Yeah, there we go. At least we got a rampage. We're getting 5 cap though. It doesn't have the strength to be able to push beacons. Um, I might just go and join my team over here. Oh no! I'm dead. Oh, it's the Newton. Oh, look at them all in our spawn. Well, there we go. That didn't really last long. We got a rampage though, to be fair. I think we should just target this Newton because we kind of need to get him out of our spawn. Why would you drop a Newton in the enemy spawn? That's not really the smartest decision you could have made. Look at the damage. That is exactly why. He's going to be done for. Look, okay, another Newton hit him. Can we get the beacon? There's no way we're going to win this. I'm just going to dash to center. Because we need beacons at this point. Oh, the healing on this thing is actually crazy. He's going to be dead instantly. Or maybe not. Okay, that's a strong Kepri. The mothership will get him, though. Um, let's go straight for their spawn. We're turning around the game. We're doing the crazy beacon run. Okay, the health on this thing is crazy. We're up to 850,000 almost. It's to do with the mothership. I have the durability extender on it. So it now allows me to get crazy amounts of health. With my Ochikochi, so... Right, this guy's done for. I swear if this rope steals the kill. Oh my gosh. There's only three of them left. We might actually be able to clutch this game. They had so many Ochikochis at the start. It was actually crazy. This Demet is going to get destroyed. There's someone behind me as well. I might actually die. Oh no, I'm somehow still alive. He did so much damage to me though. Let's go underneath him so he can't hit me. Oh, this rook needs to actually do something. Kill him. Nice. Um, yeah, I think we've actually got this game. That's so lucky, though. Look at the rooks just crashing into each other. Okay, I might die. Oh, the Dagon's getting lifted. He's done. All right, I don't know what that is, but I'm going to kill it. Ardent Emuji. He's trying to go through his portal, but he's still on cooldown. I was unlucky. The Emuji was never really meta. It, it kind of was just dead. Nobody uses it in Champion League for the portals. 
what I have noticed is it's used for that so much in lower leagues. So at this point, the lower league players are like smarter than the champion players. Which is actually kind of funny. Alright, let's try and get this kill. Oh, I'm not close enough. Oh, there we go. We got it anyway. Let's go. Well, that wasn't too bad of a game with the nether. Considering it's a nether and it got absolutely nerfed to the ground. It had one of the worst nerfs ever. Then I think that was still a pretty decent run. Oh. Well, at least we won that game. I genuinely thought we were screwed from the minute those four Ochakotchis charged into our spawn. But yeah, GG's first on the team with eight kills, six beacons, four assists, 4.2 million damage. Here are the honor points. But yeah, that was actually quite a decent run there. Okay, guys, so let me know what you thought of the nether with the tamer. If you did enjoy this video, please like and subscribe. And I will see you in the next one.